My name is Amy Pope. I am the Director General Elect for the International Organization for Migration. And I'm here today at the U.S. Institute of Peace to discuss our recent work, which is the state of migration in the East and Horn of Africa. We know now that the impact of climate change, particularly on vulnerable communities in the Eastern Horn of Africa, is already an acute issue. If you look, for example, at Somalia, there are millions of people who are on the move right now as a result of the impacts of climate change. Communities that are agricultural, that are pastoral, are facing their sixth season of drought. And if people do not have a way to mitigate that impact, they have very few options but to move and find a way to make a living, to find food somewhere else. And that's happening now. But if we think about what will happen in the future, we can only anticipate that the significance of climate change will become more and more important to the region as a whole. First and foremost, it is providing life-saving humanitarian support to those communities that are already on the move. Um, we're seeing that, for example, in Ethiopia. We're seeing that in Eritrea. We're seeing that in Somalia. But ideally, what we do more and more is help communities anticipate and mitigate the impacts that of, dis of displacement pressures, whether it's a result of conflict, of climate change, of poverty, of lack of opportunity. And so we're working with communities to create new livelihood projects, to enable them to take advantage of digitalization, to enable the skills training and labor mobility options that might exist for communities. So the range of work is significant. IOM is uniquely positioned as an organization with thousands of people on the ground all over the world. We are one of the few organizations that work on development, that work on peace building and humanitarian response. And our goal ultimately is to be able to integrate this work so that we can deliver the best outcomes for people who are on the move or to enable people to make choices about whether they can move.